unlike anything else on Earth. Those who see these monumental creatures in the wild are unlikely to ever forget the experience. With their enormous padded feet that carry them silently through the forest, huge ears that help dissipate heat, and a dexterous trunk that's capable of tearing down a tree or gracefully picking up a peanut, elephants are an extraordinary and enduring part of how humanity values and experiences the Earth. Asian elephants are gardeners of the planet that are vitally important to ecosystems. In their daily wanderings, they disperse seeds in their dung from the 200 or so plant species that they eat. Those seeds grow into trees that revitalize forests, giving us oxygen to breathe and absorbing carbon dioxide. Now, we're entering what we call the six mass extinction because the human activities related to human population growth, our consumption patterns and inefficient technologies are causing problems like uh, the loss of habitats, natural habitats, uh, over killing of species, illegal uh, trade, uh, pollution, toxification of the environment, global warming. All of this is uh, causing that, uh, that we're losing many species and many populations really fast. Asian elephants live in tightly knit family groups where females work together to raise young and accumulate social and ecological knowledge that's passed from generation to generation. Elephants maintain complex social relationships, a cognitively demanding task that puts them on par with other highly intelligent animals like bottlenose dolphins and chimpanzees. Their intelligence is legendary and they're considered an icon of wisdom across human cultures. Despite their immense intrinsic and ecological value, we've lost half of the world's Asian elephants in less than 75 years. Fewer than 50,000 now remain, relegated to tiny patches of habitat. If we don't act now, we may soon have to reckon with their extinction and its ecological and cultural consequences. Although poaching is a threat to Asian elephants, the destruction of their habitat is a far greater one. Asian elephants once roamed across 9 million square kilometers, from modern-day Iraq, east to China's Yangtze River, and south to the island of Sumatra. Now they're squeezed into just 5% of their historical territory and are extinct in the Middle East and most of China. Most are now restricted to India. In some areas, Elephants are even enslaved as beasts of burden that are forced to destroy their own forest habitats. A twisted fate for one of the world's most intelligent creatures. Due to skyrocketing human population growth that has led to the clear cutting of millions of hectares of forest, scientists say that Asian elephants will lose half of their remaining range before 2070. Because of their shrinking habitats, Asian elephants are increasingly coming into conflict with humans forced to search for food in human landscapes, a herd of elephants can destroy a farmer's entire annual crop in one night. When they come face to face with humans, the results can be even more dire. Displaced and defensive elephants kill hundreds of people every year across Asia. As a result, many farmers take action against elephants. In Indonesia, dozens of elephants are poisoned yearly by palm oil producers. At Global Conservation, we believe that a world without elephants would be a bleak one indeed. So we've deployed our proprietary global park defense system to national parks and world heritage sites throughout Asia to protect elephants and their habitat. Global park defense is a proven training and technology system for rangers and park authorities to improve park and wildlife protection. In the proposed Dana Maliao Imbak World Heritage Site in Malaysia, we're working to save Borneo pygmy elephants, a unique subspecies. Unfortunately, fewer than 1,500 Borneo pygmy elephants remain on the island, and they exist nowhere else on the planet. We're also defending some of Asia's largest remaining tracts of intact forest in Myanmar's Alungdao Kathaba National Park and Thailand's Taplan National Park. 
One of the greatest threats to elephants in both of these places is the global demand for Siamese rosewood, so we're working to stop the illegal trade. In Cardamom National Park, Cambodia, we're protecting one of the largest wild elephant populations in Southeast Asia, living in one of Asia's last unfragmented elephant corridors. Finally, we're battling palm oil, rubber plantations and logging to defend the last place on Earth where Asian elephants still coexist with tigers, orangutans and rhinos, the Losa ecosystem of Indonesia. We're working to deploy this transformative global park defense program in 25 endangered national parks and world heritage sites by the year 2025. Together with our valued partners in conservation, we'll keep fighting to save the last wild Asian elephants.